927 QLZ, the rock station. This is dirt with ya. And this is my little confection. Yes, I like poison. That's right, fellas. I love poison, okay? You got a problem with that? Yeah, okay. And, um, let's see. I went to a high school here in, in the area, listening area. And I had this, um, believe she was a lesbian teacher. She was a health teacher, right? I swore, people, she was a dyke. She had that short hair, you know. You know what I mean? Looking like, uh, you know, Rosie O'Donnell on uh, Friday night, you know. And, um, I swore she was a dyke, man. She was a dyke. That was a classification of a dyke, you know. She almost fell me in, um, hit, um, sex ed. There's something I don't understand. Sex ed, you know. What was there to get? One penis, one vagina. Do your imagination, people, okay? I am single. Yes, I am. Because... I am a horrible looking person. You know, I got only a face that a stripper can love. But I'm flat broke. There's that. Um, have this friend, yeah. You know, she's kind of uh, cute, you know. But the problem is, I would not, you know, go out with her because I got too much respect for her. I got, you know, you got that girl friend. You know, the word girlfriend, I believe. It's a bullshit word. It's a bullshit word, ladies and gentlemen. I believe uh, if you're friends with a girl, it should be called a female associate. You know, my friend, she lives in um, Christian County. Okay, pick go pick a city there. We, she is my female associate. You know, she lives in a small town. Okay, cool thing about her, she she I'm the one who popped her wrestling cherry. Talk about popping a girl's cherry. I popped her wrestling cherry, ladies and gentlemen. And, um, dogs and pussies or whatever. And, um, for real, I, it was a November show at the local uh, wrestling establishment. And I popped her wrestling cherry, ladies and gentlemen. And let's see, what else? Uh, my aunt died, great aunt died in front of me when I was seven years old. Yeah, that was really good. Um, yeah, because, you know, there's nothing that says get started in a life and then having an aunt die in front of you. And it was about, oh, Christmas Eve, too. And, um, I live in here in the Springfield community for about six years, man. I don't know how people can really live here. I don't know why, you know. People are strange, you know. Of course, I'm a little bit strange, you know. Of course, I'm a little bit Will Wonka in the Chocolate Factory, you know. I'm not the um, special like Special K, you know. Not that, you know. I mean, back to high school and stuff. This one time, I call, called this girl a dyke. No, it wasn't a dyke. I called her a cunt. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. The C word. C-U-C-U-N-T. Cunt. Yeah. Pretty bogus of me. Yeah. You're, yeah. You're saying on, in your uh, living room right now. Yeah, dude, you're bogus because they're cunt. Because they're cunt. The bitch deserve it. She's from Jersey. Go figure, you know. I used to call her Jersey girl, you know. You know what I mean? Because she, she was from Jersey. And she was a girl. I call her Jersey girl. So that's my confessional, ladies and gentlemen. This is Dirt for 927 Kilsey, the rock station.